Hi everybody. So this is a quick uh, review of the uh, Parlex Mini Stainless Steel Coffee Grinder. So here it is in the box. This is how it comes in. It comes pretty much uh, from Japan. Uh, everything's in Japanese on the box pretty much. Uh, so let's take a quick open. Um, so this is what you pretty much get in a box. Your little packaging. Then you have the grinder itself. Alright, so it comes in this little cool thing where it holds the handle. It's kind of nice. Um, so let's take a quick look at the grinder piece. This is the bottom piece that comes out. After you grind the coffee, it's in here. Little nice container. Uh, I found that it seems to be pretty nice form fitting. Okay, so this is the adjustment level. So, basically on the internet, um, what other people say is there are directions in here. See? But it's in Japanese, so it doesn't help me very much. Uh, so basically, uh, most people recommend that you go all the way tight, basically where you can't turn anymore, and then you slowly uh, turn it until you hear clicks. So I'm going to probably grind at a, a medium for a drip, so you can just hear seven clicks. That's what most people recommend, uh, but you may like it uh, more finer or you like it more coarse, but you basically turn and I'll just be quiet as I turn it and you can hear the clicks. Yep. And then you can see over here there is a gap. Uh, focus. And this is where the beans will rub up against um, the ceramic die here. So let me just undo it all the way. And you basically can see how it looks uh, once it comes out. So this is the the nut piece. See, this is the ceramic burr. Uh, I can focus on it. Yep, you see that here. And this is the other piece of the ceramic burr. Uh, this is basically how you would clean it too. You can pop out the ring, clean the rings, clean the inside. And let's get to go. So let's start this ready. Just put it back. You just have to match up the piece over here. And you can see over here there's a spring. So it's pretty firm. So that's cool. Okay, so I'm going to go with the recommendation of All the way tight. And then seven clicks. Three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so I'm gonna put the bottom back. And to load the beans, you just take off the top. And I'm just going to put some beans in here. Not really measuring, I just want to check out the grind. Um, this is a mini. This doesn't hold that much. Mm, that smells good. Okay, so I'm going to pop the top back on. Tight. I'm going to put the handle back on here. So here. And the way you basically grind this is you turn the wheel. Uh, it's not too hard. The handle's nice. Um, you may not want to do this all day. This is pretty nice. All right, so I'm not going to do the whole thing, but let's take a quick look and see what comes up. See this is what it looks like down here. So after every grind, you might want to clean it. it smells good. Let's go and put it on this napkin here. So. So because this is stainless steel. Um, most of the coffee comes out. It's not like the 
uh, the other brands, the plastic containers, where you know the static would stick to it. Let's take a look at the grind here. Oh, you could really see it. Probably can't see it, but this is like sand-like consistency, and I'm looking at it. It's fairly even, which is very nice, and this is what uh, a lot of people like about it. So. It smells great. Um, so what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to make a batch and try it out. So um, if you're interested in seeing more detailed pictures, you could probably see it in my blog. It'll probably be down there. And um, well, thanks. If you enjoyed this video, um, please subscribe. Thank you. Oh, and um, I'm back again. I'm actually not done that because I totally forgot. Uh, this is one of the main features is um, you can take out the rubber piece and what I have here is AeroPress. Right? So what a lot of people like about this is AeroPress is kind of made for travel. So you can take this grinder and you can see you can put it into the, pretty much the handle part. It pretty much goes all the way so you get maximum space savings. Alright, so um, now I'm officially done. So I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.